Based on Allie and what I know about her work, it's probably going to be two things. Well, three things. Dangerous, complicated, and, and pretty spectacular. I mean, last summer, if you guys were here, you would have seen it. It wasn't, it's not just like this sort of devised dance performance piece for a specific location. It was an event. I mean, there's a lot of people that turned out for it. We are on West River Drive. It's like the most bikeable location with the, the trails and all the bike lanes. I'm really excited just for the experience of being near the river and being on the river. We saw it last summer and it was amazing. Yeah. And we heard there's boats involved this time. This year is pretty elaborate compared to last year with all the boats that we're gonna have. And that's 10 dragon boats, 40 kayaks, 10 rowboats, uh, a couple canoes and a couple of skulls. Being on the river, I think we can all agree, is like pretty magical. My favorite, favorite view of the city is actually from the middle of the river when the sun is setting. It's been really nice being able to be outside rehearsing. We've had some really cold days, some really warm days. It's been sort of Cutting unpredictable. <laughs> Falling in the river. So, so that stuff doesn't happen in a normal dance rehearsal. <laughs> <laughs> it's a chance to get on that river and see awesome dance. The uh, Schuylkill River is a hidden gem that uh, really brings a different uh, perspective to how we can use this river and the art in Philadelphia. I feel privileged to be working with this group. They're all really creative, cool folks. First of all, it's just gonna be a lot of fun. And then secondly, it should be beautiful.